everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. To those who are new to my channel, my name is Arif. I'm currently a second year, no, I'm not second year, I'm incoming second year academic student at the University of Warwick. So for today's vlog, I'm planning to bring everyone with me to the city of Coventry, the city where I'm currently living because I'm planning to buy few stuff, doing few stuff there. So come on, let's go. But before anything, I need to pack the stuff first. I'm bringing my laptop and also a book. At least I can read if I don't have anything to do. So yeah, let's pack first. whether to take the bus stop in front of me or I need to cross the street first because the frequency of the bus stop by at the bus stop across the street uh, is more frequent than this one so I guess I'm gonna cross the street and show you the bus that I'm gonna take So yeah, this is basically the Coventry city centre. I'll go to that bus stop. Yeah. That's the bus. But I'm supposed to be taking that bus from that bus stop. But I don't think I can run to catch the bus so yeah I'll wait for another bus to come after this it's green should I run and catch the bus? no probably not hi everyone I just arrived at the bus stop and I just want to tell you a bit of information about the cost and fare of bus for Coventry area. Uh, it will be tap and go with contactless. So basically, for one trip, it will cost you £2.2. But I would suggest you to go for a day trip because it will only cost you about £4 a day. So you get an unlimited travel around Coventry area. But for me today, I buy a, then a monthly pass from National Express website and it cost me about 30 to 31 pounds per month and I got unlimited travel around Coventry area as well I use this bus transportation a lot uh, to go to university, coming back and also to the city centre so for the bus stop uh, it's supposed to do right now I can take any of these buses if you, can, if you guys can see it I can take number 6, number 14, or number 2 so all of them are due but I'm not sure yeah, the bus is here number 14 oh, this is the bus that I'm gonna take Welcome to the city of Coventry. But, uh, I'm a bit hungry, so I'm planning to go to Sainsbury first. I'm planning to buy either their donuts or their croissant because they are cheap and I would say it's convenient for you to buy them. Lah. So we'll go to Sainsbury first, and after that, I'll go to uh, Waterstone, the city of Coventry. Here. I will 
say that Coventry is quite a busy city even though it's very small compared to Birmingham and London but I would say it's quite busy because if you guys can see in front of me there's a lot of bus routes that you can take uh, and it's quite busy lah, tengok ni and there's Sainsbury we go that way I just got from Sainsbury and I bought this one which is the custard donut it costs you only one pound which translates around six ringgit Malaysia this is the city of Coventry we have Primark there It's not a big city, but as long as it provides the things that I need, it'll be fine. We have Wilco here, then we have ZZ food, but I haven't tried it before. Uh, we have Primark here. So this is the city of Coventry. Just a change of plan because I don't think I'm gonna go to Waterstone yet. So we'll stop by a Starbucks first, uh, buy a cup of coffee, and just sit inside because we need to do few work. I just wanna show everyone the pastries that they have here. I ordered caramel macchiato. And this is how it looks like. By the way, this is the first time I'm trying caramel macchiato. Usually I only buy uh, vanilla latte because that's my favorite one. But I just feel like today I want to try something new from Sabah which is caramel macchiato. I know one of my friends, uh, she likes this one a lot. So I'm trying. six inside. The first one is like re-enrollment and course registration for the next academic year and the second one I'm planning to email a uh, student ambassador. Uh, let me be honest with everyone. To complete the course registration is quite confusing because there's a lot of questions that I need to answer. Uh, guys, I want to tell you something about my tuition fee. So basically, last year it was £27,900. But this year, due to inflation I guess, uh, the fee in has increased to 28410 So can you imagine that's a lot of money that I need to pay back. Okay, I've completed everything that I need to do today and I finished my the cup of caramel macchiato. So after this, I bring everyone with me to Waterstone which is a bookstore. Let's go upstairs because they have fiction book and horror book uh, upstairs. that I don't want to buy a series because if I were to read one of the series then I need to read all of them okay. <clears throat> just a tip and suggestion for everyone if you're reading like an English book and you don't know the meanings of certain words then you can just go to your phone like search for the words so as for now I don't know the meaning of espadrilles so I just go here like if you're using an iPhone search for espadrilles so at least you know the meaning uh, of the words that you don't know so. 
so as five wheels is basically a light canvas shoes with a painted fiber so it's being used from the French era. So and other than that, if you want to increase your vocabulary, you can just go to the words that you don't know. So I just highlighted it with the pencil that I not like I don't know a lot of the words, but sometimes when you are reading a British book, they'll use their own slang and dialects. So, I just got out from Waterstone and I managed to buy a book. <laughs> so yeah, I plan to go back and read first and come here again after that. Uh, I'm arriving at Royal Cha, but I just want to show everyone this street. So basically, this is called Cross Chipping uh, Street. We have a lot of halal options that we can buy. I'm going to buy this one, but they are close. Change of, change of plan, everyone. Since Royal Cha is closed due to renovation. I'm going to a Chinese takeaway called Oodles Chinese. This is halal. Uh, it's raining outside and I just please ignore the online because they don't accept the card payment. They only accept cash here. Not sure why. So yeah, I ordered uh, fried rice with combination of a Malaysian chicken and also she's seasoned fried beef. Hi everyone, I just arrived home and it's currently So the plan for today was to buy royal cha. I want to buy a bento box for lunch. A park near my house called War Memory Park. Also, I forgot to buy shampoo because I ran out of stock. And I might need to go out again to Boots or any other pharmacy. And yeah, I guess that is for this vlog because I can't bring everyone with me out. Those who have watched until the end of this video, thank you so much. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to this channel. And I guess I see you guys later. Bye!